New Medicare cards are coming. 10 things you need to know about the new cards. Find out the status of your new card. You may have heard that we started mailing Medicare cards to everyone with Medicare. Hang tight. Mail it takes some time across the country and you might get your card at a different time than friends or neighbors in your state. In the meantime, keep us using your keep using your current Medicare card until your new one arrives. We've got three ways for you to find out when you should expect your new Medicare card in the mail. One, you can check out the map on Medicare.gov new card. Keep coming back to check the status of card mailings in your state. Once card mailings begin in your state, it'll take at least a month to finish. Keep an eye out on your email. We'll send you an email update when new Medicare cards start mailing in your state. Three, log in to your MyMedicare.gov account to see if your new card has mailed. Don't have an account yet? Sign up at MyMedicare.gov. It's a free, secure, and easy way to access all your Medicare information in one place. Now, 10 things you need to know about your new Medicare card. Your new Medicare card will automatically come to you. You don't need to do anything as long as your address is up to date. If you need to update your address, visit My Social Security account. Your new card will have a new Medicare number that's unique to you instead of your Social Security number. This will help to protect your identity. Your Medicare coverage of benefits will stay the same. It may only takes time. Your card may arrive at a different time than your friends or neighbors. Your new card is paper, which is easier for many providers to use and copy. Once you get your Medicare card, destroy your old Medicare card and start using your new card right away. If you're in the Medicare Advantage plan like an HMO or PPO, your Medicare Advantage plan ID card is your main card for Medicare. You should still keep and use it whenever you need care. And if you have a Medicare drug plan, be sure to keep that card as well. Even if you use one of those other cards, you may also be asked to show your new Medicare card, so keep it with you. Doctors, other health care providers and facilities knows it's coming and will ask for your new Medicare card when you need care, so carry it with you. Only give your Medicare number to doctors, pharmacists, or other health care providers, your insurers, or people you trust to work with Medicare on your behalf like insuredmeds.com. If you forget your new card, you, your doctor, or other health care provider may be able to look up your Medicare number online. But watch out for scams. Scams target you. Protect yourself. Medicare will never call you uninvited and ask you to give us personal or private information to get your new Medicare number and card. Scam artists may try to get your personal information like your current Medicare number by contacting you about your new card. If someone asks you for your information, for money, or threatens to cancel your health benefits, if you don't share your personal information, hang up immediately and call 1-800-MEDICARE, 1-800-633-4227. Scams, protect yourself. How can you replace your Medicare card? If your Medicare card is lost, stolen, or damaged, you can ask Social Security for a new one. Your Medicare card will arrive in the mail in about 30 days. Social Security will never will mail your card to the address you, they have on file for you. If you need proof that you have Medicare sooner than 30 days, you can request a letter from Social Security. The letter will arrive in the mail in about 10 days. So if you don't get the card, you can get a letter. If you need proof immediately for your doctor or for a prescription, visit your local Medicare, so, uh, rather your local Social Security office. And this photo you can see that is uh, Social Security official security website. Numbers and cards, new or replacement Social Security card. So that's where you go. Your Social Security office or Social Security online. How to change your address. Medicare uses the name and address you have on file with Social Security. To change your name and or address, visit your online Social Security account. 
And how do you do that is you go to socialsecurity.gov forward slash my account. My Social Security is an easy to access, easy to use portal to view and update some of your own Social Security information. So that's a great place to uh, keep up to date on your card, what's going on in your account. So check it every once in a while. Now that you have all the information, don't just sit there. Send this to your friends. They need to know about the new card too. And don't forget, we offer Medicare services and specialize in needs of seniors across the country. Bye-bye.